All right, now what I'm going to do is flesh out this landing page a little more so it's tied into my autoresponder. So the first thing I need to do is create an opt-in form. And luckily, Optimize Press has a uh, pretty easy way to do it. I think I like this form here. So I'm scrolling down. I'm finding my form. I already configured this with my MailChimp account. So I just have to uh, choose uh, what list I want to tie into. And it's Rock Hard Abs. All right, then I'm going to put a thank you page in here. That way, when somebody double opts in, they'll be taken to the thank you page so they can then download the report. I don't have the report even written yet, but that's where the, the download is going to be. All right. Now, uh, I just go through, and uh, I'm going to turn the name requirement off. I don't really need to know their names. I'm just trying to build opt-ins. I mean, I can get their names later. Then I'm going to take this text off because uh, I think it's just going to get in the way of the text I already wrote. So I think it'll look, it'll look fine without the extra text. Oh, sure. Yeah, simple to the point. All right, now I'm going to save it. And then I have to upload it. And then I'm going to test it. Oh. I, I usually make mistakes when I'm setting this up. I make so many uh, uh lists for clients and whatnot that uh, I've, I've learned uh, check your work all right so um, what I'm gonna do now is just opt in and see if I can download the report even though the report isn't written yet I just want to make sure I'm taken to the proper pages see that's a, that's that's a problem it went right to the download page I put the wrong link in that's not the page I want prospects to end up on when they hit that button I want them to only get there after they confirm their email uh, otherwise, they're never going to confirm. They get the report without confirming. So what I have to do is just get in and grab this thank you page. I'm glad I checked. Well, there's a reason I checked. Figure out why you're not getting any downloads, uh, opt-ins, it confirms, because uh, they're getting taken right to the thank you page without having to confirm. All right, so now I'm just going to uh, put that other page in the page I really wanted them to go to. Call it like a, an instructions page. What to do now that you've, op, that you've uh, requested the free report. And uh, basically it's going to take them to, uh, to a page that gives them instructions on what to do next. All right, here's a form again. Let me test it. There it is. That's the page I wanted them to get to. It tells them how to confirm their email. Uh, the only way that they'll get, ever get the report is if they do confirm their email. Then when they do and they click it, they come right here. All right, so everything's done as far as the opt-in process. I don't have any welcome emails written. I don't have anything like that, but I know at least it's tied to my autoresponder.